Hey everyone, this is Reese here, and we are at Ten Pines Bluff, and we are going to be making a nice little settlement out of this place. Um, I've been here before, and I cleaned off um, a bunch of the stuff in the original settlement area, and didn't really do too much else with it. Um, I basically just gave them... A nice little place to live other than their open-ended shack that they had and you know a little bit of seating area other than that I pretty much left everything else as is gave them some defense because it didn't really have any inspiration from the place um, and in thinking about where I was gonna go next from Oberlin Station um, this is you know one of them that I have unlocked already and kind of had gotten some inspiration for so I think that that's what we're gonna do is turn this m mostly into, I'm thinking we're gonna go with older style buildings, maybe some log cabins, um, something you know more along those lines. This is further out away from you know the Boston area and a lot of the other settlements. So not you know a lot of growth. Um, new buildings stuff like that it's kind of out of the way hard to get harder to get resources out here um, so that's what we're working with uh, I'm gonna get a little bit closer because I think I'm a little bit outside of the build area and we should be in here now so let's just kind of take a little look at what we got going on and then I will uh, oh whoops I can't do that in this mode. Alright. Get up here a little ways. Um, so the edge of the settlement is about where I'm at over here. goes clear out over here to where the cliffs drop off. Should have sped this up a little bit, I guess. Which I could still do real quick, but... Well, we've pretty much got this whole area... And it goes over to the footbridge, kind of right over here in the center of the screen. And back around. So quite a bit bigger area um, than is normally here with our expanded build limit. So I think we can make a nice, proper, cute little settlement out of it. I haven't um, stopped working on Overland Station, of course, but it's all decorating and nothing else at this point. And I needed a little bit of a break from it. I was kind of getting burnout on designing and, and figuring out where to put furniture and what furniture to use and whether to put a picture here or, you know, hang something else on the wall here type of thing. So. Thought I'd take a little break and instead of making you guys wait for me to completely finish decorating, I could go somewhere where we can actually be building and and coming up with a layout. So I think from here, what I'm gonna do then is go ahead and start scrapping everything um, and we won't make you guys watch that uh, and I will be back after the place is all cleaned up and we're ready to start putting some stuff down all right we are back and everything is cleaned up um, I'm sure we're gonna run across things here and there that I missed just because a lot of these little um, twiggy brush 
pieces can't be scrapped, and occasionally I find something scrappable hidden in, in amongst it. Um, so before I actually start building, um, just going to show you kind of what they had for a setup here. Obviously, they got a spot to sit around the campfire. It's just the two original settlers um, who I haven't even named yet. So we're going to say Shelly and... I think her hubby is out here. Yeah. Shelly and Joseph. Um, so these are the two original settles, settlers. Uh, and I'll just kind of show you their place real quick. I may pick up their entire building and move it now that the settlement's bigger. Because I kind of have an idea for this little area right here. But we're just going to leave it where it's at for now because I haven't 100% decided on that yet. Um, so they just got kind of a nice little... Oops, I'm stuck on a pole. Just kind of a nice little front area to sit, overlook. Granted, this isn't the prettiest view looking at the uh, collapsed overpass over there, but it is what it is. And then just their little, I don't know why he's in here, um, but whatever. He wasn't in here. He spawned on top of my head after I like slept in here to make it daytime. Um, but they got a nice little seating area. Um, I did bunk beds in here just because there's not that much room and um, all of that. And yeah, there's like gaps and stuff above the roof, but still better than their little open covered area that they were sleeping in. They got a little fireplace and a barrel sink. A little place to use the toilet. No toilet paper or anything, so I guess they were using uh, corn cobs. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Oh, and then like, obviously you can see I wanted windows and I couldn't really figure out what else to do here. We didn't have, there was this is a clear back before we got a bunch of the mods that we have now where we had a lot more glass and windows and stuff that we can insert and thinner sheets of glass so I just kind of did that and made it look like it has windows from the outside I guess you could say yeah so this is just there cute just make yourself at home uh, just our cute little house. Um, so I think, um, so this is kind of what we're working with now that I'm in build mode and you can kind of see how big the settlement is. Um, I'll go clear over here. stuck on a rock and they're frozen in midair uh, but yeah we can come out about yay far I am probably going to be naughty and get rid of this whole entire footbridge and replace it with a nice one <laughs> but we'll save that for later uh, and we can literally come clear around obviously you can't go all the way down but pretty close to oh I missed you come here I don't want you there um oh looks like there's some more over here oh you are gonna let me get it from here Oh wow, I didn't even come this far out to look. Oh, I guess we're down here now. <laughs> um, sorry if I'm making you guys dizzy there. Yeah, right off the edge of the cliff. So, got quite... No, 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 not the rock. Cancel. Oh, I suppose this is just outside the build zone. Because, of course, why not? Oh, or I'm not hitting the right pixel. 
Oh, come on. Guess not. Alright. Um, and I left all of these humongous rocks here. Um, for one, I mean, if you look around, it's pretty rocky everywhere, so... Um, it wouldn't make sense to get rid of a lot of these. I might get rid of some of these like smaller ones that are hanging out here and there or repurpose them for something else, but I've left them for now. Um, and where I have these turrets is where the original build line was, so it wasn't a straight rectangle. Um, it cut across this way. Uh, I had them literally scooted right to the edge. Um, so we didn't gain much ground this way. Most of it was going that direction, basically on the other side of the Brahmin feeders. Um, anything pat beyond that look in this direction is all part of the expansion. And then if we go up this way, these were pretty much all right in line. So this little bit of section over here, um, is all extra, all of this over here. And then of course all of this down here. And now that we've made a full circle, um, where we're gonna start building is right here. Um, first things first, let's move you so you're completely out of the way. Uh, you just come down here for now. Um, I don't know if this is going to be quite big enough for what I want to do as far as like length and width, but if we have to, we'll just put support beams or foundations or whatever. So we are going to go to, um, was it master plan, I think? Yes, cabin in the woods. Um, uh, let's see, I can't remember what all we have for floors here. Okay, there is foundations. And that's for the side. Okay. All right. So let's just kind of start here. Oh, what is this? Is this supposed to be dirt? It is. Okay. Or I guess it's stone. Kind of hard to tell. I don't really want that stuff sticking up through. <sighs> I hate that sometimes about some of this brush that sticks through that you can't delete. And I might have to move these a little bit, but we're just going to kind of get a general layout real quick here. Mm. Hop up here and take a look for a second. Yeah, I think that's good. And the front, the front door is going to be over here. I'm thinking, you know, this this view at the back, this is going to be like a back area. Um, or maybe, 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 hold on. Maybe it's better if they're looking out this way. So, granted, still all dead trees and whatever, but it at least is not that. <laughs> so let's move these a little, line these up a little bit different. Move you out of the way. Move you out of the way. Let's maybe try to angle this more this way. And maybe we'll have, they'll have like a deck or something off this direction. And if I have to, I'll fill more in. Okay, and then wait a minute. How far are we this way? Because I kind of I guess we're just going to go ahead and cover this whole cliff face here. Maybe, maybe not. Actually, let's just leave it. Let's just leave it. 
can't make up my mind. Surprise, surprise. Oh, and then I fell off a rock. Rock of foundation. Whatever it is. That's too close. That made me sick. Sorry if it made you dizzy. Um, there we go. Grab you. Hop in there. Let's hop over here. here now the only thing is is I actually think if we're gonna go the other direction then maybe we go here and here yeah we'll go this way and I think this is gonna be big enough um, probably gonna be a, a bunch of like smaller you know, houses and maybe multiple stories, but not like big, huge. Is that overlapping? Guess not. I thought it was overlapping. Um, you know, not big, like huge, nice, fancy buildings or anything. Although... These log cabin looking ones are kind of nice, but. Probably should have waited for this part until I decided whether or not this was big enough, but. We're committed now, so we're just going to keep rolling with it. Um, we've been seriously going back and forth about whether or not to add a greenery mod. Um, ew, I don't know. Was there taller ones in here? No, there's smaller ones, but the way these angle out, I don't think that's gonna work. Ruh -roh. They don't stack either. Okay, well, take these back out. I will finish what I was about to say, but now that I discovered this, we just gotta get rid of it. I can probably go around those um, with something else from one of uh, our other mods. It didn't even occur to me that those wouldn't be the same length as, you know, the foundations, because, you know, why would they be? <laughs> um, still like this mod, though, so... No shame. Um, but yeah, we've seriously been considering getting a greenery mod because uh, let's see, what do we want to maybe these lighter colored ones. And I'm going to start with just the wall, all like solid walls for the moment till I kind of get a layout and then we'll put some windows in and we will at least need a doorway so I can get in and out of the same color. That row. Maybe if I look at it from this direction. I think it's that one. Yeah, there we go. Um, you know, all of this extra time that we're putting into landscaping to add some green back in. Um, just to kind of mitigate that. Not that we wouldn't still do some of that, level out some ground, and then I never put a door in. Oh yeah, I did. I put it over here. That's not where I wanted it. There we go. Um, do I need stairs to get in and out of here? I do. I just want to use my jetpack. Because um, one of the things that I've always struggled with um, with this game... Why are you doing that? Just snap to the... Uh, you don't want to snap to where I want you to. Um, you gonna make me put a floor out here? Uh, is the fact that... You know, it's been 200... Uh, do I need to turn surface snapping off? I'm sorry. Let me get this sorted out and then I'll finish my thought. <laughs> 
all over the place today. Mm, no, you still want to snap the wrong direction. Um, is the wall backwards? Is that what's going on here? I mean, I didn't think that really mattered, but maybe it does on this one. And of course, it probably just snapped right back in the same way. Um, well, what is going on here, man? And this is probably all for no reason, if I'm being completely honest. It's still going to do the same thing. Um, alright, so let's do... Do you have a small wooden floor that's not super fancy? I guess that one will work. Maybe. Let's jump down here. not where I want you. Oh my god. <clears throat> About to get frustrated. <laughs> Alright, fine. You go in here then. No. No. There you go. And then let me bring you out, right? What is going on, man? Never had so much trouble building one of these. go right there. Now you're going to be stupid too, because why not? And try to snap everywhere but where I want you, but that's fine. Because I got a trick for that too. And you didn't even make me do it, so that's fine. Alright, now, will you snap where I want you to now? Pretty please? Pretty, pretty please? Thank you. Rough, okay. As I make sure it wasn't because I was using like a rough piece or something stupid. Alright, um, so do we want to go two stories on this? I think, probably. So, let's, uh, no. I think we're gonna go with this. Uh, they do have the big ones. Okay. There we go. I don't know. I guess it just depends on which way the light is. So I feel like they're not all the same color. But I'm pretty sure it's just the way the light's shining on them. Alright, where are we going to put our stairs? Do I want to do maybe, I think I do. So let's put stairs there and let's go back and get a floor. That's a roof. Let's go back and get a floor. There you go. So I need you to go that way because all the other logs are running that way. Um, and then let's do, come on, come on, there you go. And then what I usually do is just, because I'm pretty sure this is going to be sticking out outside a little bit, but maybe not. Let's go check. Let's go check. Oh, not in this one. We usually just bump this out a couple, so it's not quite so, uh, in the wall over there. There we go. Like that. And then that kind of, you know, puts it in line, you know, with this railing also. Matter of fact, I think we can even bump over one more. There we go. Okay, so let's come up here. And there we go. Uh, I think we're running this way. Yep. 
And we should be able to do one more right there. Now here, make sure. Okay, I can still get up and down that. And then, um, I don't know if this one, yeah, that's not gonna run the right way. So we're gonna have to do this. There we go. Oh, I guess I only needed a one by a there anyway. Back up we go. Okay. This one doesn't have, it does have a fireplace, I forgot. Um, I don't know if I want to use, so what's the difference here? Um, it's not bad. It's getting darkish already. Uh, what is the difference? Just the different wood styles, I guess. Oh, that's right, because you put your own fire in it on this one. Um... Yeah, I don't think so. I think I'm going to do my own, like, we'll do a different fireplace and I'll do my own chimney and everything with it. Um, those work great for, like, a single story cabin, but not so much for more than one story. Alright, so let's see if we can pop these walls up real quick before it completely... Um, the sun completely goes down. And then I'll make it daytime again. Okay, so back to what I had started to say. Um, it's one thing that's always driven me nuts about this game is that, you know, 200 years later, you go into Sanctuary and there's dead leaves and, you know, dead leaf piles everywhere, you know, from the fall. Um, you know, so October or whatever, fine. My problem with that is, is there's no trees of any sort with foliage on them other than, you know, the random hub flower or, you know, mutated fern, whatever. So where did they come from? They can't still be left from before the war because, of course, everything would have been incinerated. Um, you can't have, do we want to do a grass roof on this? Hmm. I don't think so. Maybe I do. I don't know. I don't think so. Well, let's just stick with a <laughs> regular roof. I might do that somewhere, but I don't think it here. Or at least not on this house. Um, but anyway, so where did they come from? They can't be from before the war because everything would have been incinerated. Um, so if they're from after the war, well, where did they come from? And if they did come from new growth and trees, where are those trees at? And if those trees aren't anywhere no close, okay, fine. Um, but it just doesn't make sense. And I've seen all kinds of different arguments for it, but the biggest thing to me would be we would either we would still be in nuclear winter and everything would still be a recovery, everything would still be desolate and dead, it would still be super dangerous to be outside, not just during a rad storm. And don't get me started on the whole rad storm thing, that's a whole nother another thing. Um, but so either it's a desolate, wasted land um, where there's still not much that can survive or stuff has started to regrow um, you know and come back to life so if it started to regrow and come back to life then that means there would be trees and then those leaves would make sense because you know it's I believe I can't remember but I think it's fall or October when you <clears throat> leave the vault so if it is, then, you know, that would make sense if there were some trees around and whatever. But you would start to have 
some grass and like you would still have tons of dead trees and, and some would have decayed some would have fallen over yada 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 but some of them would have came back um, new sprouts new growth life finds a way sort of thing there would be grass coming back um, there would be all kinds of bushes and weeds coming back um, just like you could still see animals um, there would be more and more animals coming back you know whatever managed to survive um, mutated sure I, I can handle that I can I can live with the fact that they may be mutated or whatever um, I wouldn't have a problem with that do we want to do this or do we want to do a corner roof on here instead maybe not one with grass though Let's check out the corner roof. Let's see what that looks like. Um, you know, so that's just, just, you know, one of the things that I think about is, is, you know, why is everything so desolate and all we have is mutated ferns and, and stuff like that? Um, and I haven't played Fallout 76, but I feel like in Fallout 76, you know, there's more greenery and stuff. And maybe the justification for that, I can't, I think that one takes place in West Virginia. And having not played it, you know, I don't know if there's like a, you know, a crater like there is, you know, here. Where it's really close to the bombs. Or, you know, where some of the bombs fell type thing. Um, let's see. How do we feel about that? I mean, other than the fact that we need more windows, I think I like that roof line better. Let's get out of here. Maybe, uh, took a quick break and I'm back so let's get started on this next house um, and I think we're missing a little bit of audio because I forgot we mapped the microphone mute button <laughs> to a key that we occasionally use so we're gonna have to change that um, all right so, there might be some missing audio, but I'm sure we will fill it in with some nice music. <laughs> um, let's see, where do we want to start this one? And I think let's go to, let's just see what's in, um, oh, well, I still need to be in here. Um, let's do something from here. And just so we can get above the grass, we're going to use the shack foundations, I think. Yeah. And let's see, maybe we'll... Um, so that's 
that's three. Oh. Um, maybe this one's going to be three by three. Maybe. How close to the edge does that get us? Mm -hmm. Um. Get rid of that one. Oh, we are not all going the same way, are we? Um, so I think we're going to go with this. Yeah. All right. Now what do we got from for walls? Um, I think this is going to be mostly Yeah. I gotta decide what I wanna do. Here, let's put our front door on here real quick. Um, Cause I would like some windows. So I think we're actually gonna go to the half walls here. And we're gonna fake some windows in since there aren't any in this set. Just for privacy's sake, I think we're probably gonna... Not have windows on this side. And they don't have windows, that way they're not looking creepily into each other's house. <laughs> Maybe this one's just going to be all one floor. So let's maybe... Hmm. Decisions, decisions. I think I, uh want to put one more of these shaft floors. Whoa, why did you... Oh, that's a different cabin. Okay. I forgot we had that one. Alright, we're going to be using that somewhere in here too, probably. Here we go. This is what I want. And that should be the correct way. Got an odd deer. Got an odd deer. Are you going to make me take the wall out first? Did I have two there? What the heck? There we go. How did I end up with two there? Did, did y'all see me put two down there? <laughs> Don't know how that happened. Um, yeah, I think we're going to go with that. All 
Alright, you, mister, can go back in inventory. Okay. Oh, this might be a little tough for a roof, but we'll figure it out. Um, do I want some kind of front porch on here, too? Probably. Everybody deserves a front porch. In my opinion. Alright, what are we going to do for roofs here? Because... Close to theirs. There's angles, but we're going... Three wide. And I don't know, they don't have... Oh, they do. They're kind of crappy, but they do have them, so... Otherwise, there's these, which I'm also not that crazy about. And then we run into the... Oh. The problem of what to do over here. You know, let's let's just roll with it and see what we get. And let's see. Oh, you're not gonna want to sit there without a wall, are you? Um, you'll probably snap to this one though. So, alright, now the only other problem I have with these then is, will these corner pieces fill that in? Maybe? Not really. Looks kind of silly, but let's see what we got. But at least it's not like open on the end, so I think I think I can live with the fact that it doesn't quite cover the whole thing. So we're gonna do it. Or not without the wall. So I might have to put a regular wall in here just to get these started. And we're going to need one more regular wall anyway. Because here, you know, I'm, I'm going to assume that the majority of the people... Um, are gonna have, you know, heat, uh, wood heat source. Not that they won't have any electricity, but it's not gonna be you know, plentiful, I guess is the word I'm looking for. Oopsie daisy. Oh, whoops, I gotta move this wall over real quick. Fake it till you make it. It's too bad I can't squeeze these little ones in there. They're like the wrong, wrong angle though. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. Well, we definitely wouldn't be able to do that one anyway. 
one since that wall's over there. Yeah, it's just the half point of that, so. Yep, that's not gonna work. Okay. I tried. I tried, I tried, I tried. There, you can go there. Let me steal you for over here. Stop it. Oh, oh, you were there. You were there. Come on. Gotta be looking in just right. You know what? Too high. There we go. Jeez Louise. Might be able to do something else with that to kind of fill that in. I like how they're two different peak sizes too. Like they're not quite the same height on either end. It's kind of cute for old and decrepit. <laughs> All right, we're just gonna stick you back here for now. I guess we should get some stairs going so we can stop. <laughs> falling off of this, so let's uh, decide what we're going to do for... I don't know why I went all the way out of the wood. Um, do we have... yeah. Um, that's an upper floor I don't want. Do you want an upper floor? Do you have... That'll work. Whoop, come back here. You were in the right spot for a split second. There you go. There you go. That'll be their little porch. Uh, yeah, that'll be fine. Now we need some stairs. I hate that one. I don't know if we can find some railings for this, but... We'll see. Speaking of railings, uh, no. Why was I thinking there was a railing section right there? It's fences and walls. No? Um. Is it in miscellaneous? Ah, there we go. It's in miscellaneous. Um, how do we feel about these? These kind of match. I don't know that we have half ones, though. Well, I kind of like those, though. Actually. Yeah, I kind of like these ones. Stop it. There you go. Let's take you back. Okay, I guess they're supposed to be that far down. I think I've used them before, but I don't know how long it's been. Ooh, that one's kind of... Maybe we'll just do the smaller ones. They're not quite as ratty. Mm. And that's what I thought. So we're going to... We are going to have to move the stairs over. <clears throat> Let's move them here. That'll be fine. 
Makes the windows all kind of high, but I guess I'm okay with that. Where are we going to put the kitchen and the fireplace? So I know what I want to do with windows here. <clears throat> oh, are we all open on this end too? Uh, um, I can put something else there, I guess. Which means we're open over here too, huh? Yep. Um... Or... Do we want to just double roof this, maybe? Let's see what that looks like. Other than the flashy, flashy, this might be the way to go. Especially if I, there we go. Not quite the way I want it though, is it? No. There we go. that'll be okay and then what I can do is just come down one. Oh, it's still gonna flash really bad though isn't it hmm whoops that's the wrong direction Although that might have fixed it. Down one. Down one and over. Down one and over. No more flashy flashy for the moment anyway. Um all right, so now where do we want we're gonna come in I think we'll have the kitchen right here and we'll have a bathroom and bedroom over here, so let's put the fireplace right here in this corner. And I need you to drop uh, you need to come in towards me one. And maybe go down one? Or more? What do those look like over here? Uh, I think that's okay.
I don't know why I thought I could jump out that. Okay. So, let's figure out... The whole window situation there. from <laughs> might have to build a little tiki house too <laughs> probably not here though um okay so let's uh windows we're looking for windows i gotta remember where i found the glass was in No, it wasn't in there. Um, hmm. It might have been in Kuro tab. I don't think so. Maybe it was in Snappy. Ah, yes, blast. I can't see what that looks like, so... I think that's the one I was using. And we just have to size it down. Not that you can even really see it. course it is going to be too short. Was one of those enough? Hmm. I mean that sticks out up there but it's technically by the time I get a corner post in here I don't know. Don't know, man. Alright, what else do they got for glass? Um, wait. Are these small, tall? Okay. By the time I... Yeah, by the time I size those down, there wouldn't be anything left. Those are all crappy. Why are those all gonna be crappy? I guess we could do like crapple glass, maybe? Whoops, what does this look like? I can get it in here in the right spot? This might not be horrible. I actually kind of like that. We would just need something on the top. I have a feeling these are not going to snap though, so I'm going to have to be very meticulous about how I line them up. Alright. So yeah, let's, let's go with these. 
to place place hmm. may not want let's do here and I think we're gonna go back to a full wall on this other one so let me get rid of that. See if we can get these lined up in some sort of way fashion here. Let's start with that. It's definitely crooked. <laughs> and then, oh, let's grab nope. I need you. And let's bring it in like that. been too far. Yeah, this is all about like that. So then this one. We're not far off though, are we? Are we whoop? Should be closer. Mm, this might be further off than I think it is. Alright, so we got. Let's look at this one. Oops. Let's move you over. Whoops, that's the wrong button. Let's move you over. Go and over. Then you need nudged up. Just oh, nope. I don't know if I can raise you enough without messing everything up. Pretty close. That's also pretty close. Uh, let's see. Sorry, I don't mean to keep jutting forward like that. Every once in a while, the controller has a mind of its own. Just go that way from me one. Just trying to move a little bit at a time, thank you very much. I mean, that's pretty close. By the time we get a post in between there, you're not going to see it anyway. <clears throat> and then this one is going to be partially covered up with wall, but that's okay. So let's try to get the height right first here. Or maybe not, because we're not even on the thing. Okay, are we on the middle one? Yes. So I need... Um, This way for sure. And then that's pretty close. I can live with that if I can get a post there and there. Hmm. 
Oh, slow down. Slow down. We're gonna do this, we're gonna need two more. So let's put another one there, another one there while I kinda sorta think about this for a minute. So first let's go get our full wall. anything in here. Oh, that might actually work. If we just did a doorway. That's the right one. Make those small little windows. Yeah, we would just have to get this lined up right and we would be good. see that through there so if I go back one do something like that and then what does it look like on the outside oh but then you can see it on the outside oh and it's broken I didn't realize some of them were broken that's not what I want are these ones that way too by golly they sure are well, dag nab it. Don't want to put broken windows in. Okay, well, I will rethink this then and figure out what glass I want to use. That's not the right button. Um, and I'll we'll go ahead and do that off camera, and then once I figure out what glass I want to use, um, kind of go from there. As far as, uh, you know, putting it in, and I'll show you what I decide for that. Oh, I forgot these two whole things anyway. So I think I'm going to call it here for this episode of Ten Pine Bluffs. Um, if you have any ideas um, of what you think you'd like to see me build with in here, um, let me know. Uh, we've got like Castle in the Sky, Cabin in the Woods. Uh, let me just pop back in here. I want to kind of keep it all wood, maybe wood and stone. Um, and like over here, um, I'm going to be using some of these pre-built or prefab prefab cabin pieces to make you know something um, maybe we could do some that's gonna be in here maybe we can do some stuff from is it in CVC I think Maybe it is not CBC. Um, probably definitely some stuff from Kiro. Is it in G2M that I'm thinking of? Yeah. Like maybe, you know, some of these sunshine cabin pieces. And I'm not saying we can't use like any metal. Um, I just don't want anything like super new and fancy, uh, you know, like the, um, like for instance, we have the vanilla pre-war sanctuary houses, you know, stuff like that. I don't want anything like super new, fancy like that, or like marble, you know, some of the stuff that we've been using in some of our 
our other buildings. Okay, guys, so I think this is where I'm going to call the episode. Uh, and if you enjoyed this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. And we will see you in the next one. Bye.